Hey guys, we are going to make some cave drawings today with chalk and some white paper. Um, here is an example. You can go with animals, you can go with swirlies. It's up to you. Um, here's another example. If you want to go with arrows and chains and squiggles. Here's another example, a little more nature, the snake, the paw, the arrow, the swirlies, the sun. We're going to make something like this, boys and girls. All right, so we're first going to put a nice big arrow. I'm going to put a line like that with my chalk, pick a color that I like. And on the end, I'm going to put a triangle. And then I'm going to shade in that triangle. And then on this side of the arrow, I'm going to put some sideways V's to kind of make it look feathery a little bit. All right, now that I've made my arrow, I think I'm going to make um, a paw print. So I'm going to put a circle and I'm going to give them some little paws. One, two, three, four little circles. And I'm going to shade those circles in too. on it a little bit just to spread the chalk out. All right, I think I want to make some swirlies. So I'm going to make a swirly here and a swirly here. I can use whatever colors I want. And if I want to mix up the swirlies, that's okay too. I can put them anywhere I want to put the swirlies. I might go with one more fun little color. I don't have to put any swirlies if I don't want. I can put whatever symbols that appeal to me, boys and girls. Here's an example of what I can do. Um, if I'd rather go with like more nature like with a little sun in the corner I can do that too if I want to put you know a guy holding an arrow and some uh, neat little other things maybe a half eyeball or maybe I want to do some more nature some animals it's up to you boys and girls thank you so much for listening